First, our big story. It is proof about the dangers on our roadways. A motorcyclist records a woman cutting him off. Now, tonight, that motorcyclist has a message for the driver. He spoke exclusively to News 6 reporter Eric Sandoval. And Eric, he says he was lucky to have his camera at the time. That's right, and actually he got that camera just a couple days ago for Christmas, Ginger. You know, uh, Kevin says he drives his motorcycle everywhere, and he was actually driving northbound here on Orange Blossom Trail yesterday afternoon. That is when this driver went off the roadway, literally went to where I am standing right now, cut him off from turning onto Carroll Street right behind me. And it's what she said in her defense that really made him mad. Watch as motorcyclist Kevin Schrader almost collides with a car that appears to cut him off at an intersection. Now take another look as we slow down the video. The car comes from Schrader's right-hand side, drives off the roadway onto the shoulder, not only preventing him from turning at this intersection, but putting pedestrians and other cars in danger as well. If she starts to pass you on your right, you, you look over, what, what are you thinking? Um... That was close. <laughs> Schrader caught what happened on a camera mounted on top of his helmet. The camera clips into this case. And he says he had his blinker on, so he has no idea why the car's driver would cut him off. He decided to go after her, to ask her. Hey, I want to talk to you. Why did you do that? No, 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 I want to talk to you. You can see the woman behind the wheel cuts him off again, this time rolling up her window on Schrader before the discussion could go any farther. She looked like she was pregnant. I saw she was rubbing her belly like mothers do. And so my mom would be distraught if I was killed. What if it was her son, her daughter, that was riding? And you know, it's cameras just like this, helmet cameras and dash cameras that are helping authorities find more and more suspects in just this kind of situation. So, what does Schrader want to see happen with this woman who was behind the wheel yesterday? Find out in the story I'm putting together right now for 5 o'clock. For now, we're live in Kissimmee. Eric Sandoval, News 6.